wow, wow, it's so big. You can literally have a party here. What's up, FH fam? It's your homeboy here, LD, and welcome to yet another home tour video. And this time, we are in an exclusive listing in Lapu Lapu City. Let's go inside. It has started raining. This house is already furnished. It's not fully furnished, but it's already furnished. And this is the entrance. They have stuff here that they will install, especially in the bedrooms. This, the floor area of this house is 151 square meters. So these are the things that are here so far because it's furnished. It's not fully furnished again. So they have the sofa, the TV, the tables. I think they're, go they're going to leave the fan here, so not sure yet. This property is in Aldea del Sol. It's in Lapu Lapu City. It has a good front yard and it has a garage good for two cars if you open the gate. Can fit two cars. Oh, right there. oh, sorry. Can fit three cars if you open the gate. So the garage is quite big. It has that sliding door that directs you to the garage. You have no neighbors, so <laughs> I mean this is a subdivision, but you have no neighbors over there, so there's no one really out there to judge you. If you do anything at the facade of your house the lot area is 132 square meters and it is a single detached meaning it has a front yard side yard and a backyard with bananas there are bananas here so if you have pet monkeys or if your kids are just like monkeys it has its own water so in the Philippines, we call this pozo. So you can just pump water if water is not working. Ah, wonderful. More sili. What's the English of sili? They have your own plant over here. It also includes the aircon, which is nice. Let's go back inside. It's raining. That's why I went inside first. Sorry, guys. Huh? Then we go to the this, this is the CR. We're not open with that. Then here's the kitchen. Uh, ref included this count this counter. So, Kuya here is the one living in this house. They're having lunch. It's lunch time. Let's check out upstairs. It has three bedrooms and a roof deck. I want to see the roof deck. Since it's raining, I grab my crocs. the roof uh, let's go there in a bit let's start with the bedrooms this is the first bedroom oh it's quite dark but it's a big one it has an aircon already big room about, mm, about five square meters a lot of stuff here because someone is living here and tomorrow this will be rented out um, this is the master bedroom with a king size bed or queen size bed with its own bathroom and has a built in cabinet or closet another big room over here so this is the third bedroom about five 
square meters plus. It's also as big. Can fit a king size bed. Maybe a queen. So that's not to cramp the entire space. Already has an aircon. High aircon. So all the rooms have been provided with aircon. So that has that room has an aircon. This one has an aircon and fan. And this one as well. So it has been already furnished. So the things that you need when you move in is just the bed, I think. Yeah, just the bed. Maybe a study table, a work table. So let's go try to see the outside. This is the roof deck. It's still raining. You can see it's super wet. Uh, this is your view in the morning. When you want to have coffee, Just, ju you just have to install tables and chairs. All right. Growing up. Wow. Wow. It's so big. You can literally have a party here. See? Water. So no worries for uh, if there's problems with water by the government. Look at the roof deck. Wow. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Look, look, look. Nice. So I think most houses have roof decks. So that house has a roof deck. That house has a roof deck. That other house. That house. That small house. That one. They all have roof decks. What's up with the design here in this subdivision? But it's nice, it's neat. You just put out tents and then you can spend a night here with your family or with your friends. Uh, it's quite steep, but you have to be very careful in going down. So this room or this house has been rented and if you the buyer is very keen very interested in buying this house you will assume all responsibilities as a lessor that means whatever amount the tenant gives you whatever the in the, whatever was in the contract you will be the one to receive them so you're already an investor when you buy this because this already has a tenant for a long-term um, contract. Yeah, it's nice, right? Did the rain stop? I want to go outside. But downstairs. Ah, it's still raining. So I think I'm going to stop the vlog here. And uh, very nice house, very big house at, uh, what, at, what's the floor area again? The lot area is 132, the floor area is 151, it's quite big. It's affor relatively affordable, if I may say so myself. So, I think that's it for now. See you in the next video. By the way, before I end, I would just like to highlight that the house is near the playground and right at the turn is already the entrance the guard house so there's a playground it's very quiet here very open and look you have no neighbors so peaceful all right see you bye